Have you ever wondered how to spot a psychopath? Welcome I am, and today I will be discussing the 10 subtle signs of a psychopath. Now you might think psychopaths are easy to identify with their charismatic charm and captivating personalities. However, beneath that allure often lies a manipulative and dangerous personality. Understanding the signs can arm you with the knowledge to protect yourself and those around you from potential harm. We're not just talking about the obvious signs, but the subtle ones that are easy to overlook. These are the signs that can help you understand the psyche of a psychopath better, potentially saving you from falling for their manipulative tactics. So, are you ready to explore the mind of a psychopath and learn about the 10 signs that can help you spot one? Let's dive into the 10 signs that can help you spot a psychopath. Starting with the first sign, superficial charm. Psychopaths are often known for their charisma and magnetic personality. They can seem incredibly charming and engaging, but this is usually a facade, a carefully crafted mask designed to draw you in. Moving on to the second sign, inflated self-esteem. Psychopaths tend to have an inflated sense of self-worth. They see themselves as superior to others and often display an overbearing sense of entitlement. Their ego knows no bounds and this can be a clear warning sign. Let's talk about the third sign, manipulation. Psychopaths are master manipulators. They use a variety of tactics, including gaslighting, lying, and emotional blackmail to control and exploit others. They have a knack for making people do what they want, often without the person even realizing they're being manipulated. Now, onto the fourth sign, pathological lying. Psychopaths are habitual liars. They lie with ease and are incredibly convincing. Their lies serve to manipulate and control those around them, and they often create complex webs of deceit. And finally, the fifth sign, lack of guilt. Psychopaths typically don't feel guilt or remorse for their actions, no matter how much they hurt others. They don't take responsibility for their wrongdoings and instead, often blame others. This lack of conscience is a hallmark of psychopathy. These are the first five signs. Now let's move on to the next five. Continuing with the sixth sign, emotional detachment. Psychopaths often don't experience emotions the way most people do. They may have muted or absent emotional responses. This isn't just about empathy, but also joy, sadness, anger, and fear. It's like they're watching life through a frosted glass window, not really participating, just observing. Moving on to the seventh sign, risk-taking. Psychopaths don't fear danger the way most people do. They are thrill-seekers, drawn to risky and potentially harmful activities. This craving for adrenaline can lead them into dangerous situations without a second thought. The eighth sign is irresponsibility. Psychopaths often avoid taking responsibility for their actions. They can be very adept at shifting blame onto others or creating excuses for their behavior. They don't accept their mistakes, but instead, they find a way to make it someone else's problem. The ninth sign is a parasitic lifestyle. Psychopaths can be like parasites, living off the hard work of others. They may not hold down regular jobs or contribute to society in a meaningful way. Instead, they prefer to take advantage of others, using manipulation and deceit to get what they want. Lastly, we have the tenth sign, disregard for rules. Psychopaths can have a blatant disregard for social norms, rules, and laws. They believe they're above the rules that the rest of us follow. They create their own rules and believe they're justified in breaking the laws if it suits their needs. These are the 10 signs of a psychopath. Now let's summarize. To recap, here are the 10 signs of a psychopath. First, superficial charm. Psychopaths can be charismatic and enchanting, but beneath that charm, there's often a lack of genuine emotion. They express affection in a way that feels shallow and insincere. Second, inflated self-confidence. Psychopaths usually show an overbearing sense of self-esteem. They always consider themselves right and have little tolerance for criticism. Third, manipulation. Psychopaths are masters of manipulation. They use lies, deceit and trickery to get what they want. Fourth, pathological lying. Psychopaths are constant liars and concealers of the truth. They can be very persuasive when it comes to their lies. Fifth, lack of guilt. Psychopaths don't feel remorse or guilt for their mistakes. They avoid taking responsibility and can shift blame onto others. Sixth, emotional unresponsiveness. Psychopaths don't experience emotions like sadness, anger, or joy the same way most people do. 
their emotional responses can be weak or non-existent. Seventh, tendency to take risks. Psychopaths aren't afraid of taking risks and may put themselves in dangerous situations. They may be in constant pursuit of excitement and adrenaline. Eighth, evasion of responsibility. Psychopaths avoid taking responsibility for their mistakes. They can shift responsibilities onto others or make excuses. Ninth, parasitic lifestyle. Psychopaths often live off the efforts of others without working themselves. They can adopt a parasitic lifestyle. And finally, tenth, disregard for rules. Psychopaths may struggle to adhere to rules and laws. They may try to create and enforce their own rules. Remember, these signs can help you identify a psychopath and potentially save you from a dangerous situation. Recognizing these signs is crucial to protect yourself from such individuals. It's not about labeling or judging people, but about understanding certain patterns of behavior that can be harmful. Knowledge is power, and in this case, it can be a lifesaver. Knowing these signs is the first step in protecting yourself. By understanding the subtle hints that may indicate a psychopath, you arm yourself with the knowledge needed to navigate potentially harmful situations. Remember, these individuals may appear charming, confident, and even charismatic, but beneath the surface, there could be a darker personality at play. It's vital to stay educated on this topic, not to label or stigmatize anyone unjustly, but to ensure your own safety and well-being. These 10 signs are just a starting point, and it's always recommended to seek professional advice if you believe you're dealing with a psychopath. Knowledge is power, and awareness is the best defense. So, keep these signs in mind, and don't be afraid to reach out for help if you need it. Thank you for watching. If you found this video helpful, please like, share, and subscribe for more informative videos. Stay safe, and always be vigilant.